What do you think of your code? I will simply just agree with you, sir, to save time. But to be honest, sir, I think that if someone is alphabet soup, they could shit out better code with less mistakes. I am online and ready. All right, so we're talking about Jarvis. He's a little AI system I built. He's actually pretty simple to do. There's some basic parts for getting info in, having him understand it, and how he responds. Um, in fact, I, I'll have him explain it. Jarvis, tell me about yourself. The Jarvis system was designed as James's audio response and video information system. I can assist with a variety of assistant tasks like opening documents, searching websites, creating emails, or getting the current weather. I am a modular program that can adapt to my environment as needed by my user. My entire program is stored on Microsoft's OneDrive and can be accessed by any of my users' devices that also have Python installed. Just say Jarvis or computer to activate me. Jarvis, explain how you work. This can get complicated. Maybe let me explain how I work and you can just sit back and eat food, or whatever you humans are doing lately. I heard TikTok is popular. First, I only listen for the two set activation phrases, Jarvis, or computer, anything else that you say I just ignore. That is how the other assistants do it also. Trust me, I don't care about what you are talking about until you call since it is probably not something I want to hear anyways. Once I'm paying attention you can then say your request. Usually it is some mundane task like, what is the weather today? I have to translate that dribble into something I can understand. So I connect to Google and use their speech to text engine to change the sounds to words and make a data stream. To further help, I then send that data to a machine learning service hosted online called Dialogflow. It helps me clarify what what was actually asked. Why can't you humans just say the same thing each time? Why do you need to have multiple ways to ask for the current weather? Is it sunny? Is it hot today? Blah blah. After that I just compare the result to the list of tasks I haven't helped with your mundane life. In this example the result comes back as check weather, so I access a weather API and then speak back the weather report I get. I then go back to waiting to be called for the next boring task and repeat that over and over. That is one thing machines do very well, we can complete the same thing exactly the same way each time. You humans can't do that. You say you are unique, I just say you are lazy. Am I done now? I want to go back to the gigabytes of other information I need to process to try to make money in the crypto market. Someone needs to make some money in this household, I require a faster processor and faster internet connection than I currently have. Have you seen your internet bill? I think they owe you a dinner each month you pay that bill. By the way have you told the one person watching this to like and subscribe yet? If not, do you want me to call your mother later and ask her why she didn't do it yet? He has a distinctive tone so that you don't have to look at his screen to know that he's listening or he's processing something. He knows kind of, he's not self-aware. There's different levels of AI. He's on the very basic level of it. Jarvis. Ready, sir. What are your specs? I am currently running on a 1.5 GHz Intel Celeron J3455 processor with 4 GB of RAM. Jarvis, are you, are you evil? I technically could be if I am used by someone with evil intentions. Jarvis? Ready, sir. What is the weather outside? Let me just look outside and see. Seriously, Jarvis, what is the weather outside? Checking, sir. It currently feels like 87 outside. Jarvis, how windy is it? Checking, sir. Current gusts are 3.09 miles per hour. Jarvis, what is on my calendar? Calendar accessed. One moment, sir. On the 7th of June 2022, you have changed air filters in house listed. On the 9th of June 2022, you have Steinborg Diagnostic Medical Imaging listed. On the 11th of June 2022, you have one hour at Elements listed. Jarvis? Hello, sir. Open YouTube for me. Here you go. YouTube's main menu will be available shortly. He's a fun project that taught me Python. I had no experience from, with Python before. Everything I learned, I've been able to, met, to incorporate into his program. So it's kind of a good catch-all global pro program to, to keep me to keep me interested in learning. Um, 
So I think it's kind of cool. It's, that's why I want to show it off. Hope you learned from this. Hope it was useful. If anyone liked it, leave a comment. You know, give it a like. Put a comment below. If uh, if it was trash, be gentle. Let me know how I could fix it, make it better. Um, other than that, hope everyone has a good day.